hello beautiful people uh welcome to our channel like share and subscribe uh so it was said that uh, alex oti spent 927 million on uh meals welfare packages in three months 25 million on public schools and at the same time um you know you just you know just reading the news just shows uh the priority you know even though i i support p2b and uh, people have been saying that Ellis Olu have been trying in road infrastructure. I just feel this is a a wrong direction he's, he's taking, you know. Um, this money could have been used for other things. Why should they be feeding themselves? Are they not working? Are they not? Do they feed civil servants uh, that work in, in Nigeria? You know, I go through the comment section and I see a lot of people defending him. You know, it's so shameful, you know. Is it, it is criminality at the end of the day? That's just the simple truth. This does remember when P2B was saying that when he was governor, that some people will come and say they want to eat in the government house, and he told them, No, be eating in your house. That's how it should be. Government house is not a place for people to come and eat. You have salaries, it's from your salaries to feed yourself. Or is that do civil servants, federal civil servants, do they have any where gov government feed them? Come on. You know, people have been praising you, you know, for some time now, saying, oh, you're doing well, you're doing well. You know, some people are seeing it as blackmail because almost today or yesterday, I think Lagos State government was also reported to spend a whooping amount of money, billions on refreshing and, uh, you know, whatever, you know. And now today, so uh, it's, uh, the Sabia is spending uh, 107 million of food in three months. I think uh, Oti should come out and clear the air, you know, so that that's government. It doesn't mean if you're supporting somebody, it means that you must be foolish. You must stand on something that is right. He must come and explain to us how he spent this money. Because this is the last one of money. Do you know how many agricultural machines this money can buy? Do you know how many tractors? Eh? Let's assume with the inflation, maybe one tractor is 100 million. At least you can buy uh, your bought nine tractors, right? You can use it to do a lot of things. You know what a tractor do? A tractor can do the work of 40 men, you know? And you can use it to revolutionize agriculture in your state. See, you people should stop defending things that are not good. It doesn't matter whether it's your own person or your own party. It's not easy, actually, to criticize somebody um, from your own um, enclave. You understand what I'm saying? Even if it's your father. But let's you call wrong, wrong. If it was Lagos State Government, or Kaduna State government to hear this news, you will not question it twice. So now, because it's Alessotti and they say he's doing one or two roads, it still doesn't mean you should uh, um, um, absorb him from this thing. How can he spend only 25 million on public schools and 900 to 7 million on meals? I know that governance is not easy, but you need to be firm and harsh. I've always said it, I always used to tell my friends that if I enter into government, me, I'll be wicked. My wickedness is not because I want to be wicked because, um, uh, you know, doing the wrong things. You are, I want to be wicked doing the right things, doing things for the populace. Imagine if we spend this 907 million on 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 schools, maybe one or two schools. You know how upgraded that school will be, or uh, building, busy to build one uh, primary health care center. It's better off. Come on, people should stop wasting Nigeria money. You understand? This is how the criminality is, this is how this criminality is going on all over the states in the country. People should not turn a blind eye to it. Say, oh, he's doing it rude, he's doing... No. So far, as far as I'm concerned, even though PDP messed up the state in the years, 24 years or thereabout, or whatever, 20-something years they have been there, it doesn't mean because Alex Solitz started doing one or two things, trying to do one or two rules, and it doesn't mean that he has done anything so far, as far as I'm concerned. There are a lot of work to be done. A lot. You understand what I'm saying? That's why I always used to maintain that I've not seen any Nigerian leader that has worked 70%. As far as I'm, 50%, I don't even think any of them are worth 50%. When you're really working, those are your airlines, they will be angry with you. Very, very angry. You'll be doing it for the populace. They will come and fight you with all manner of things, spiritual, physical, and everything. So, Alex Oli, people have been praising you so far. This is a wrong step in the wrong direction. People should stop eating there. You are, you, you people are paid salary. Use the money to do the right thing. You understand? Some of you are now comparing what's happening in Lagos and they say, don't defend evil. It's bad. What is bad is bad. It's not easy to criticize him, call him out. But what is bad is bad. You understand what I'm saying? He must return that money. 
You understand what I'm saying? That money, they were all they must cut off. You know, his wasteful spend it. It's almost like what uh, Tinibu did went to uh what do they call it? Uh a UN meeting to spend five hundred thousand dollars that Nigeria million dollar I'd be worth that Nigeria doesn't have. So please, just stop, please oh, don't just cut this thing up. People have been praising you. But so far, as far as I'm concerned, you have not really done you know, a building of road is not is not really anything. There's a lot of work to be done. Is your fourth ten or they wish to judge you? There is a lot, a lot. I've said my own. No? I know some of you will come under the conversation to attack me. Anyway, what do you make of this whole thing? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section.